What made you say yes to doing this documentary in the first place? It was kind of a therapy thing and a release of uh, built up resentment and stuff that I could actually get out and let the public know the truth. Okay, so when you say resentment, because I can totally relate to this, and I think a lot of people can, resentments in terms of in a former relationship, you build up resentments and you tend to project them in future relationships. Um, so this is a therapeutic thing about, Joe, getting it off your chest. Correct. It was, there was years of um, mental abuse and other things that went on. Well, I could tell you, I've walked down that road too. So I totally understand. Um, I will say though, knowing that and learning more about Joe, you did still come across very empathetic mm -hmm. towards him. Even Donnie had said something. What did you say recently? About I just him? thought you were the most sincere person on the show by a mile. You seemed just not, if you were, if it was therapy for you and you were getting things off your chest, it didn't seem like you had any malice or any intent to hurt anyone you were just telling your story and it was really sincere. I, I mean, there was a moment where you, I think the interviewer told you something that you didn't even know. About the, the FBI. Yeah. Informant. And you were like, and you were surprised. It was like everything about you seemed so honest. I mean, I found myself, you know, waiting for you to come back on screen because it was like, this is the one person who doesn't seem to have an agenda. Right. Other than to just tell the truth. And again, you didn't seem like you were trying to hurt Joe. You were just trying to tell your story. Exactly. That's all I was trying to do was just get my side out, just like everybody else on documentary. 